Each time we write, we compose for different reasons. In this short video, we will discuss CRAFT, an acronym for the rhetorical concepts writers keep in mind during their writing processes. This acronym can help a writer determine when, how, and why they may decide to use certain things, like words, phrases, or genres, for different writing occasions. CRAFT provides a broader lens and a wider context for the writer to consider the rhetorical situation for which they are writing. Rhetorical situation can be described as the bubble all authors exist within when they write. For example, our cultures, friends, relatives, and beliefs all serve to shape and reshape how we compose and comprehend text. So let's explore craft. The C in craft stands for context. This is a writer's purpose and situation. It answers the question, why are you writing? The purpose for a writer are the actions or action that they take in academic and personal ways. This could include telling a story, persuading someone, or describing something. The situation is the time and space, as well as the demands of the writing task. The R in craft is role or the voice that you use when you write. This could include vocabulary, sentence types, and tone. And many of the aspects of voice are determined when considering audience. The audience is the person or people for which you are writing. They are the readers, listeners, or viewers of the text, both intended or incidental, primary or secondary. The F in craft stands for format. This is the form or types of writing you are producing. For example, format can include genres like a speech, an article, a letter, or even a script for a video. The T in craft is for topic. This is the subject matter on which you're writing and the focus of your piece. By remembering craft, we can intentionally consider our thinking processes as writers while also identifying, exploring, employing a writer's craft 